hi welcome to Rao. today video i'm gonna show you how you can connect to the 60 volt 45a powerful controller to your electric scooter first i'm going to show you the wiring diagram and then i'm going to connect it to this two motor here and make it run so you can see how you can connect it to your electric scooter the wiring diagram is pretty simple the the controller come in two parts you have the controller itself here and you have the harness right here so on the controller itself the wiring diagram is uh, is like this you have uh, you have this connector that is right here this connector is your hull sensor connector then you have those two white wire that are self-learning wire it can be used to reverse your electric scooter direction rotation direction you have uh, those three wire here green blue and yellow that are your motor face wire and you have this battery connector xt60 that is right here and it is the same for the both controller and then on the on the harness you have uh, three wire that has two female connector and you can notice that all of them has a red and black wire they are the power coming out from the controller then you have uh, this wire right here the color is uh, red blue and black it is your throttle connector there is also a second throttle connector this one the color is white and green both are your throttle connector then you have this wire here both wire are blue this is your single dual connector you have this wire this is your eco turbo connector when it connected it just limit your motor speed to 25 or 30 km per hour and this is your power ignition keys color is uh, orange black and red and you, you have this one the rest two connector that has a bro wire they are your brake connector this is your electronic brake and this is your cable brake so now you know on the wire here the connector that i will just use to run these two motor are the total connector the power ignition key connector the single dual drive connector eco turbo connector and then eco turbo connector i will just use those wire to run my two motor this is my eco turbo single dual drive button connector and my my throttle is right here the throttle work with this display tf 100 with five pin i already connected the connector right here and i also have my power ignition keys that is right here so let's get it connected now it's pretty simple i'm going to connect the controller itself first first disconnect your battery power your battery connector so you can work safely and when you finish all the connector now then you can plug your battery connector yellow to yellow blue to blue and then green to green motor face wire is good and then i connect the hull sensor 
so the first controller is good now i connect the second controller same thing going to green yellow to yellow and then blue to blue I just connect the hand sensor. Click. Good. Controller is connected now. Now I'm going to connect the harness. First, I'm going to connect the power ignition key. This one is the power ignition connector. And you can see how the wire are connected. Is green to red, black to black red to orange if you miss a connection here you can destroy everything and then i have a echo table single d drive button the connector over here this one is a echo no this is single single d drive and this where is the other one over here the one that has green and black this is a uh, echo turbo oh, my throttle the throttle is also important for connection you can see red to red blue to blue black to black if you miss a connection a connection here too you can destroy your controller or you can destroy your throttle and the second total connector is a uh, green to green black to yellow so the connection is good so I just connect the single D drive button power ignition keys and the display so now I just plug it in, it doesn't matter which controller you plug, it's hybrid. Click, make sure you hear the click. And now I finish the connection. I can connect my battery power here and then the second one on the second controller. Around here. Puff, here puff is a good sign. connected you can see my power ignition that is already on and this is my throttle turn it on push the power button for three seconds and boom it's on let me press the I can see the two motor are running to test the echo turbo, let me use this one here. Two motors are running. If I press this one, the single deal, now you're going to see that only one motor is going to run. You see? If I press echo turbo, now you can see the speed is just limited to 25 km per hour and even if I press the single deal, deal drive even with the two motor it running at the same speed of 25 km per hour if I take the power goes up you enjoy your scooter at the max speed. So this is how you can connect this 60 volt 45A controller to your electric scooter. If you find this video helpful, please like and subscribe. You may be helping someone else trying to get this controller connected to his electric scooter. See you at the next video. 
and have a blessed day thank you for watching and bye for now